Assalamu alaikum people, this is Akrams and you're watching about one minute tutorial. In today's lesson, we are going to learn how we can model a bazooka ball. Open a new scene and create a plane. Move the subdivision height and width to 1 and draw a reference curve as shown. Now select your multi-cut tool and draw 11 points as shown. Draw another line from the center of the right side and connect it to the left top corner. Make sure you have 6 points in the line. Once you are done with your lines, start combining those lines with the multi-cut tool so that you have a good topology. If your lines are not straight, don't stress too much for now. We can correct them later when we have all the points in our scene. Once done, you can delete the reference curve. Draw a straight line from the middle as shown and make sure the last point you put exactly in the middle. Now with the help of a multi-cut tool, draw an edge around this line in the middle from the outside and inside. This line in the end is going to define our panel. So it's going to hold the shape of the panel in the end. Connect the last two points as shown and merge those two points together to have a clean flow. Once done, just correct the flow of the topology. Now move the pivot point to the top left corner and align it on the grid as shown. Now go to your duplicate special option, reset the settings, click instance number of copies 3 and type 90 in rotation Y and click duplicate. Now select any of the shape and start aligning those vertices as shown. Remember to clean out the topology if necessary. Draw a small edge here so that it's a complete line. Once you have cleaned all the topology and aligned those points, combine all the four shapes together and delete the history. Now select your shape and create a mesh network and create a cube. Type 2 in the scale value of the cube and in the distribution type of a mesh network click the distribution type to mesh. Connect the cube in the input mesh and change the method to face center. Now select your mesh repro mesh and duplicate it. Move it aside and go to deform sculpt. Scale the sculpt up so that it's a sphere. Now select the following two faces and isolate them. Select the following edge loop as shown and delete the rest of the part. Do the same thing for the other part. Now for this part make an edge flow as shown and delete the middle edge. Once done select your mesh and then select the group of the mesh repro mesh and align the pivot points. Once done, duplicate your object 4 times and rotate them 90 degrees each. Combine them and delete the history. Select all the vertices and merge them. In the end, select all the following straight lines and delete them. Once done, select your mesh and again the mesh repro mesh group and align the pivots. Now select everything and delete the history. Select the outer edge loop and go to create set set. In the end smooth it once. Go to your quad draw tool and smooth your mesh if needed. Now duplicate your mesh and rotate it 90 degrees. Repeat the steps until you have your complete ball. In the end select everything and go to deform sculpt and scale up the sculpt. Now select the members of your sculpt and go to deform cluster. In the scale value of cluster type 0.99 and press enter. Thanks for watching. 